All right, day zero of TruckCon. At the airport now, just waiting for my flight. Or not. Yeah, I'm actually still working today. I'm going to be flying out tonight, actually. And then arriving tomorrow morning. Calcetil, they greet. Prenefes Celernotipo. It is my honor to star in Ger Person of Cusar Remarca Perli Ponei. You have Aceton there, the festival mining, and to you, Donter have trophy. You have the better, most great. It was the friendship. That was the prize of all. J and J and J and. Hey, guess what? I managed to find at the vendor hall uh, one last copy of a John Kenz's Kaleidoscope Collection CD, a deluxe edition. I had the regular edition from when he was selling it online. And there were actually a few more copies of the regular edition here as well. But I uh, never got the deluxe edition in Everfree. Apparently it's got some bonus tracks and stuff. Um, if I can finally update that metadata in Music Brains. I'll be, I'll be honest, that's actually the primary reason I got this. I mean, I kind of posted on Twitter before how the Music Brains metadata for Pony Music is lacking. And I figure, you know, Getting some physical CD releases onto there would be helpful.
Breakfast, which is basically an uh, English muffin sandwich, you probably get the same thing at McDonald's, plus uh, 10 bits. Not a particularly inspired food selection. Yeah, the, first time I heard this, I was like, what is this? I don't know what to do with this. Now it's like the best song ever. <laughs> Sing along if you know the words. The best song I've ever made. <laughs> character is tomorrow morning and I'm doing the uh, 2011 wrap up uh, today where we're gonna pretend like it's the end of the year 2011 and talk about all the goings-ons in the fandom um, thanks for coming uh, I'm so glad you guys made it like I put a lot of work into this so I'm really proud of it I hope you guys liked it hope you learned something uh, here's number one the spark overture by Forrest Rain oh, yes
the show, third place, Abby Holmes. <laughs> Best in so show, second place, Pepper Gardner. You made your parents proud. <laughs> and last but not least, our best in show first place goes to Nicole Blosser. <laughs> Hopefully the light of the princesses will guide your way. I hope to see all of you and more cosplayers for next time, please. <laughs> Thank you. getting autographs got a few more signatures on this box here and way too many sweets from Ellie Ray like geez living <laughs> no are there any argum are there first of all you could spoil this are there any catalytic converters in this fic no okay no thank goodness they, we have to add one now. Oh. They were going to be, and they got taken. Oh. Yeah, there, there, there was one, but it got stolen. <laughs> right, of course. Yeah. Silly me. All right, so I think we're all situated. Uh, welcome to a completely ordinary VA script reading by Argenbarger. Uh, yes, that deserves a round of applause, I think. It's, it's been a wild time up here because we all received the scripts just now. And we've all kind of just been looking them over and going, okay, where am I? Who am I? What's going to happen here? Um, I, think, I think the person to sort of intro, co-intro this is the man himself, Aragon. Would you like to tell us a little bit about what we're doing today before we introduce everyone? Sure. So today we're reading a brand new, never before seen uh, screenplay that I wrote. Uh, started about... Well, pre-thinking pre about it since, like, last TrotCon, but really only put pen to paper, like, 72 hours ago, so. <laughs> um, we got a lot uh, in here, though, and we do have a uh, full-color copy for the uh, charity auction, so everybody else gets to deal with laser scan, just black and white, so. And it's kind of confusing because there are no names, there's only pictures. Some of the, some of the pictures have names, so we are going to just, we, we prepared some of uh, the people with the most lines with who they are, so they should hopefully be prepared, as prepared as they can be. Um, Cole, uh, I think your, your ter terror bar is pretty obvious. There's a pirate terror bar who's also self-labeled, and then the, the, the Christmas version of you is has a cutlass. It's the only one that has a cutlass. So you're the one with the cutlass, and uh, we'll pick you up if you miss it. But uh, that's totally okay. We're here to get through it together. There's no page numbers, and we're just, uh, you know, it's how it is. It's it, it's not your typical, completely typical script reading. No, not at all. No. I, I just listening to you explain it like it's talking about like you're analyzing a baseball game is really quite astounding. I have to say, and it's true. Everything you said is 100 percent true. Um, before, yes, yeah, someone keep track of keep track of statistics out there. I don't know what statistics you'll keep track of in an Argenbarger fic, but 
You can do it. Calling balls and strikes. Errors. Errors. Yeah, there's too much going on here for me to track errors like we did yesterday, but. No, no, it's fine. It's we're all gonna get through it together. It's chaos. It, it, it's chaos. I will say we should make sure every line gets into a mic, so we might have to pass around a lot over on this side. So just bear with it. But uh, and. Uh, I guess we'll introduce who we'll be passing it around to, or who already has mics. Uh, joining us on the left side, your left or stage right of the panel, <laughs> we have uh, we have everyone joining us tonight. We have full papers, Foley. Welcome. I have absolutely no idea why I'm here or what the hell's going on, but hi, thank you for having me. Yay! That, that's genuine. That's <laughs> That's kind Happy of to all. see all of you. This is there aren't any Australians in the audience, are there? No. Yeah. Okay, good. I'm not going to owe anyone any apologies. There will be this. now that you're here. <laughs> and that's a perfect transition into our next guest, Ellie Ray. Okay. There we go. There is glitter hey, in the water. There's confetti in the water now. Oh, it's all good. Uh, okay. <laughs> Part of a balanced breakfast. There you uh, go. <laughs> next up, we have Devin Dalton. Hello. Joining us through the power of the internet is Mr. Cole Howard. Yeah, yeah, Cole Howard in the house. Then uh, it's me, Thoth Penswell. I'm one half of Rip Ponies, and I'm one half of the social media team of TrotCon. Hi. Uh, anyway, come to TrotCon. Yeah. Thank you. No, no. Thank you. They did come to TrotCon. Uh, jumping over to the main man himself here, we'll get back to that later. We have uh, Forward Progress. Hi. It's me again. <laughs> Uh, yes, you know me from Keeping Friendship Magic and probably about 15 other panels this weekend. So, uh, thank you for coming to TrotCon. I found out this morning I was on this, so thank you. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lundrock. I'm the other Thoth. So, okay, so uh, Luck here has lovely, been lovely enough to step in and he's going to read the parts for Timber Spruce for us in this yep. script. You're Brian Doe. So, uh, yep, hi, Brian. Say something Brian Doe would say. Avocado. Boy, do I like guacamole. <laughs> it's, it's... <laughs> Spitting image. And last but certainly not least, Hello, I'm Essential. I'm the guy in the red polo who wants to be a pony. If you want to be a pony, and you think you want to be a pony more than I do, you're wrong. <laughs> and, uh, and we'd be, we'd be very um, remiss, I suppose, to not introduce the one and only, the man who has written this, uh, this literature in front of us. It's the one and only Mr. Argenbarger himself. Argenbarger! I'm exhausted. <laughs> let's, let's have fun tonight. All right, so I think we are, if there's no other people to introduce, no other questions, no other anything others, I think it's about time we start this script reading, don't you yes. think? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it, is it not visible? That's for tech to do. Let's see. They put on the fancy lights for us, they're rainbow. You're, you're going to get a good idea of what we're in for as soon as it goes up. Oh, it's tiny. Oh, it's in the corner. Is, is that okay with you? Oh, there, right. oh, there yes. it is. Excellent. Okay. So, yeah, I heard an oh no immediately. <laughs> the audience has already clued oh. in. So, uh, without further ado, I think we're ready to go. Pass the mic to who, uh, pass the mic around here and uh, let, there we go. First page. Huh. <laughs> They got a low to the shakes around twos due to employee carelessness or overwork, which made it worse because of new and old injuries. Oh. Ow, ow, ow! My apostable thumb is caught in your hoof hole thing. <laughs> oh, Selzy, please stuff some puts in there like a towel or a paper towel for safety. Is a dark box here that here we're stuffed in. It's a saint show that we get out of. <laughs> 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 oh. 
for Ruth. For my hoofs and my limbies. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm so crushed that it's bad for my knee. <laughs> I got a knife. I got a knife, what for to my king's sister? That is real cool, but please don't stab our ass with a calcitrite converter. Oh. <laughs> Let's use all of the box we're being. <laughs> it is dark. And let us out! Please out of box! I said box! Please, yes! Make cuts! And box! It's fresh! It's fresh!
like that. I see 10 bucks over there. Take it away forward. All right, uh, 15, can we go 15? I see 15 over there, can we go 20? $20 for some signed croissants, anyone? $20, all right. See if we can't up that, 25, $25 for the signed croissants. Now if you're in on the bid, let's keep those hands in the air. We'll yeah. go over the bidding cross. So we're at 20, so keep your hand up for now. 25, we're looking for $25. Got signed by Ellie Ray, myself, Nova Rose, Foley here. Lots of lovely folks. Anybody? 25. I see 25 back there. Anyone playing at 30? Anyone else? So 25 is the current high bid. Got 25 there. 25 that going once. Forward. 25 going twice. And sold for $25. All right. So that's a good example of how the bidding works. So we'll get you your item in just a moment. If you're bidding on an item, we'll say a number. People who are interested in getting that item at that number will put their hand in the air. We'll increment the number higher and higher until only one bidder remains. If you are the winning bidder, the place to pay is at the back. We will be taking cash, we will be taking cards, we will not be taking Bitcoin or balloons or anything like that. Uh, and then we will get you your item. Absolutely. Also, please give it up for Stormtrooper, who is our charity lead this year. Woo! So, uh, they don't print these anymore, except by very special order if you happen to know who makes them. So who wants it? 20? Is that what I heard? 25. 25? 30. All right, I got, raise your hands, raise them up. I got two. Now you got three. I've got one there, one there, and one there. Awesome. Keep going. 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 95 in the middle, 95 going once, 95 going twice, sold! Is it a comfortable scarf for you or you can tell us firsthand? Cotton and wonderfully warm. What more of an endorsement could one ask for than that, Fiora? Let's start the bidding off for this at 20 bucks, please. Let's see some hands in here. 60! 60, I like! Who else is in at 60? One there, one there, one there, and there, one there. What about 80 then? All right, how about 100? You're out at 100, you're in, you're in, you're in, okay. Oh, we've got one in the back too. What about 120 then? Uh, 140. 160. Flip it around. Three in at 160. Two in at 160. Out at 160, so one left in at 160. Anyone else? 160 then, you have me at 160? 160 going once. Again. 160 then, going twice for the Are You Ready Corn official scarf. Sold for $160, thank you very much indeed. Well, it's slightly cursed because it's from a convention that never happened, despite, I think, nine attempts is what I was told? Yes. 11. 11. 11. I live there, they tried to get me to come. Oh no. 11 times. 11 times. Indeed. So, uh, who wants the, uh, who wants the box from the convention that never happened that doesn't exist? Oh, wow. Speaking of curses... Pay you ten dollars. <laughs> I have to pay you? No! Alright, they got two in at fifty, right? Three. Oh, no. Sixty! Seventy! Eighty! 90, 
100, 110, 120, 130, two up here, 140, 150, 160, 170, or the last dangerous question, 200. Check first time to hit 200, if I'm not mistaken. One of the folks we've got here is Samu in, in the front. He's come all the way out from Germany. It's a huge round of applause for Samu. He's been a wonderful guest. Uh, they've been a wonderful guest at all the online cons and now here as well. Here's the question. Are you going to wait until you get back to Germany before opening this? Oh, oh. we're in some trouble. <laughs> all right, I got 200. Two in. 225. 250, 275, 275, going once, going twice for the box that shouldn't exist, sold! <laughs> Guys, the curse box is finally coming home with me! <laughs> Sam has saved for the curse! Saved once more. If you don't know, the last two times we auctioned off current uh, curse boxes, my friend bought both of them. The first time, we got a flat tire on our way home and had to spend the night in West Virginia. The second time, the car broke down completely. <laughs> Have fun flying home. I love you. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm going to England. He ended up in the same plane. Uh, uh, Trocon is not responsible for any actions that happen beyond the walls of this convention. <laughs> one of our wonderful staff artists that is here this weekend is the one and only Gleamy Dreams. Shout out to Gleamy Dreams. Let's give them a round of applause. I can't tell you, this woman comes up with idea after idea, and I can't even begin to tell you, I, I, I'm, I'm amazed by it. So, we have this lovely mug right here. I can't see from there uh, what all ponies are on it. Is this our... No, I think this is the G5. Sunny Zip, we've got the, the main five from G5 on here. And we also, if you saw a little company called Canter Logic in the G5 movie, we've got this lovely little drinking container emblazoned with Canter Logic. These are unique as heck items. Come with the straws too, so you can consume. And straw cleaner. Not something that's easy to find actually. So, amazing yeah. items here. Can we have a starting bid on these items here? What do we want? We gotta have, we gotta have some awesome drinking containers for going through the conventions here, going forward. $100! One hundred dollars. That's a lovely place to start. Can we go to one ten? One twenty. One twenty. How about one thirty? One thirty. One forty. We still have it? Nope. One forty. Any other takers? I'm yeah, gonna have that. Yeah, here, here. here. One fifty. 160, 170, 180. I'm gonna go to the 200. 220. Oh, 220. 220 going once. 220 going twice. And so. Pony closet, what? A week's worth of shirt? Seriously. Huh, I don't know. I mean. That size medium. Individual, okay. We do as the crowd asks. Let's start off then with this medium, the Fluttershy in green. I think that's green. Help me out on color blind. Fiora, is that green? I'm completely serious. Is that green? Because it could be brown and I really wouldn't know. You're a green pony? I don't know. I legit don't know. I'm glad that I've learned something new this weekend. I'm sorry, I thought that one had just died on me. Ay, ay, ay. So let's start off the bidding then on this wonderful green. I'm sure it is a green Fluttershy t-shirt in size medium. Let's start the bidding off on that at 20 bucks. Let's see some hands in the air at 20 bucks for a medium Fluttershy. I've got one hand there at 20, hand there at 20. Okay, what about 25 then? 
Oh, uh, what about 30? Out of 30, you're in at 30? Happy at 30 for the medium Fluttershy t-shirt in green? Okay, 30 then going once. 30 then going twice. Any other hands? Then sold for 30 bucks. Thank you very much indeed. Certainly already. Anyone else? Uh, Two it then at 50. Three it. Four. Oh, for crying out loud. You're trying to make my life difficult, aren't you? Fine, fine. I'm going to put it down. Can you just, just over there so I can actually watch? One there, three up here, fine. What about 60 then? 70? 80? Ah, out of 80, out of 80, out of, 80, out of 80, one in at 80. Were there any other hands then? Okay. You have stolen it from the auctioneers then at 80 going once. 80 going twice. If they will actually let you have it, that is 80 soul. Well done. Thank you. Woo! All right, next up. I'll hold up this one then. Please do. We've got the red. Again, I'm, I'm guessing. Could be brown. All right, we've got yin and yang Celestia and Luna here. See, I like that one, but I'm not a size medium, so there's no point fitting on it for me. But um, where should we start that up for? Well, let's see if we can get uh, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. We got a few 20. How about 30? How about 40? How about 50? 50, I still have one for 50, any more for 50? 50 going once, 50 going twice, and sold, $50. Woo. Oh goodness, we're down to our last shirt here. Okay. I'll hold this up if you want to get it started then. All right, the one this. and only, Queen Chrysalis. Queen Chrysalis. 
Get prepped, everyone. Why do all the items have to be cursed? Welcome to Trucon. Why can't we have something nice and pure? There's a like literal... A, like a freaky Donnie you. Darko-esque mask. I mean, that's just lovely and not remotely cursed. That one's my fault, I'm fully, sorry. Fully, fully. There's a literal crack in behind it. Big curse here. <laughs> I mean... The thing I love about this is the fact that Ellie Ray is tied to this. <laughs> yep. And in fact, so did Devin Dalton. Is uh, is Inky back in the crowd? No, Inky's gone. Okay, that's okay. I don't think we need to wait on Inky to auction off a couple of the items he threw in. But let's uh, ah ah. I know the item I'd like to do next. Have you seen this yet? This was donated by the one and only My Little Ties, Igor. Wow. Oh. That is a solid piece of jade that has been laser etched. Oh my gosh. Could we, uh, can we get someone to show this around in the crowd? Fiora is apparently that someone. This has to be seen up close to be believed. Like solid piece of jade etched in with the one and only Miss Mate. I was some nerd thread here. I forget the character name. Oh, that's not Miss Mate? What is it? It's a Kieran. Those are the Kieran. Autumn Blaze. Autumn Blaze. Yes, Autumn Blaze, thank you. Autumn, Autumn Blaze. Blaze. Six hundred then. Anyone else want to play at six hundred? Six hundred then going once. Six hundred for this beautiful day pennant going twice. Congratulations, you're taking it home for six hundred dollars. Guests who uh, did a few panels with me this weekend that we're going to bring out. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, please give your hands together for the Rip Ponies, Lot Manuel and Adrian. Wow, that was quite the introduction. Hey, everybody. Hi. How y'all doing? doing? That good. I like that. Cool. So we've got like four or five items to our name here. So do we want to? Do we? What? What are we gonna put all this in? Hmm. How about we give them some literature first? We got the. Uh, do I got the book back there? Yeah, we have the book. Oh no, we're gonna do. All right, we're doing. We're doing some of these. Okay. okay. So. This lovely item was donated to pair with us. Cool. Woo. The one and only Nicholas Cage that we warned you about earlier. I the love that. One and only. I love that. Woodcrafted and everything. <laughs> Thank you, dear. Hard pulled woodcraft. Now, gotcha. on top of that here, uh, I do a little panel called My Little Tonight Show. Some of you might have heard of it. Gotta display those. We have the lovely uh, Shrek mask signed by, oh my god, how many signatures do you have on this? So Did everybody who was on the Tonight Show signed this. Show anybody that. who was Show a that part of crowd. it here. Show that to the crowd. Including the <laughs> word damaged right here to describe it. But we've got Ellie Ray on here. We've got Devin Dalton, myself, Nova Rose, Ace. That's me. Uh, we him. also have our two runners, Exodus, and that Luckrock is on his way, literally here right now, to sign both of these masks for you as well. So if that's a big difference maker to you to have Luckrock signature on it, then there you go. But then we also have, also, uh, this was added in, uh, our friend Exodus <laughs> donated Shrek Operation. Then we played a Drink Ponies last night. It was great. These two played that. So we're yeah, I want to. This off it's and true. a whole set of beautiful signed merchandise, complete with the one and only Gangster. This package deal is available to you for this limited time right now. Can I hear a nice starting bid for this wonderful set of collectibles? Fifty. I like fifty. Sixty. Eighty. One hundred. Oh, these hands. One twenty. Oh. One fifty. 175. Stand strong. 200. 
225, 250, 275, $300. I'm going to try it. 350, 400, 400, 400. Any other takers at 400? 400 going once, 400 going twice, and so You get Shrek. <laughs> Excellent. I just watched 400 dollars go for those. That's awesome. Oh, no. It's a pretty cool item, I gotta say. So, uh, we brought a sword. Uh, a real sword. <laughs> That's a real sword. Um, yes, I love it. And uh, do the honors. So that's real stainless steel. <laughs> And the, cup, the holster is signed by all of the community guests, or at least most of the majority we could find. All of the wonderful guests of honor we had this weekend. A bunch of artists, a bunch of musicians, and it comes with this lovely hat as well. And the hat is also signed by the same. Same of course. The so, same guests of honor, the same musicians, the same uh, community guests. This, this, display here so like I said there's some caveats um, you need to pick up this sword at the end of the convention you cannot have this around it's also a display sword a cosplay sword but it's a looker signed by a bunch of the amazing folks we've had this weekend and uh, I think you'll get a couple of stories out of it leaving that in your living room someone comes in comes in one day why do you have a sword trot come so, if you would like this one-of-a-kind stainless steel sword, this pirate sword with hat combo, signed by all the guests of honor, the community guests, artists, musicians, then uh, this bundle here is for you, hat and sword. So, two disclaimers. Four. You must pick this up at the end of the con, not now. Yep. But you have to pay for it now. You get two. If you flew here, you better have a check back, because TSA will take this. <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> so. We're not responsible if TSA gets it. Exactly. So, I'm going to say we start at, how about 50? 100. 100. 100. 150. 200. 300. 400. 500. Oh, wait. Okay. Two. 550. 600. 650. 700. 750. 800. <laughs> 800. Okay. We just have one. Just have one. 800 going once. 800 going twice. And that is sold for 800. Excellent. Man, I'm jealous. That's a cool item. <laughs>
magic's going to happen for sure. Spank that unicorn. <laughs> oh! Come back, honey. I'm well. Oh! 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 Woo! Things are coming out. The unicorn poop is coming out. Oh, the unicorn poop. The unicorn poop. Ah! for the moment. Okay. Track on! Let her go! Let her go! Argy! Well, we need to let Cole Howard finish because he's the best of all time. Cole, yeah. Cole, okay, Cole, Cole. Cole, you realize that um, you owe me one hug for every time I've seen you but not seen you. So you're up to like three or four now. You realize this? At least, at least, and I'm and I'm hoping I can fulfill those hugs in January, uh, in July, and uh, or at least uh, at least get a at least get a start on them. You know. We um, already are. Yes. That's yeah. one of those uh, things that we plan for months ahead. We're already talking to be cold. Don't tell anybody. It's not like we're in a room of hundreds of people or anything. Uh, I just wanted to say that as I was sitting here just now and watching you, you all uh, just talk and be amongst one another, and I've seen you guys be amongst one another in a digital space, but it was so warm and so incredible to see it happening in person, and I wish I could have been there because um, you guys really have assembled a dream team, and it's just, uh, it's really awesome to watch you guys glow uh, in these closing ceremonies because you deserve it for all the hard work that you put in. Um, it was wonderful to watch from afar. I wish I could have been there in person, but I'm just really grateful that you guys have um, opened this experience up for me and let me be a part of it digitally. And I, I really look forward to doing it in person because uh, you're all really terrific. Everyone I got an opportunity to speak with and all the panels that I was a part of, it's just, 
it's a really special thing. So I can't wait to do it in person. And I'm just really proud of you all. And I just, yeah, I'm really grateful that I get to be a very small part of such a massively important thing. So yeah, but uh, I, 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 like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm always excited to watch Ellie go and just do her amazing, manic, and uh, wild thing. And, but I'm just, I'm really proud of you all. And I'm really grateful to be here, uh, even digitally. So. Hugs and kisses, and yes, for there are hugs coming. Oh, oh, oh! I know it. <laughs> God, that sounded weird. But Phillies and gentle colds, give it up for Cole yeah! Hour. Yeah! Woo, 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 woo. All right. So, without further ado, please welcome Alan. second just so that I'm not choking on my own lipstick. Um, so the uh, pizza brigade, we had a little panel, sorry, it took us a little while to coordinate um, <laughs> to the hourglass of getting here, but we are here and we are met. And I just need all you pirate ponies to know that this weekend has been so gloriously special and so wonderful, and I'm so happy that I got the opportunity to share it with you all, because we've been waiting for a very long time to come together and share the magic, and you represent everything that is so, so very magical and beautiful and required in our world right now. And I wanna say thank you to each and every one of you, every single one of you ponies that have come out and I've had a chance to hug or say hello to, or sign an autograph to or share some candy with and some sparkles and some joy and some love. It's because of you that this show happens. And as a voice actor, uh, an actor in general, you're what makes this entire thing happen. You make it happen. Nobody else does it but you. And if it weren't for you and it weren't for this love that you bring, this magic that comes together, the show wouldn't happen at all. So I need to say thank you to each and every one of you for raising the bar at a time where a lethargy of spirit, a despair, a depression, a fear, and anger has come into our world. And you keep us all together still. You guys need to know how beautiful you are, how just incredible you are, and how much you mean, not only to each other, but to the world, because you're the biggest part of the show. You're the biggest part of My Little Pony. You're it. Forget about me. It's about you. And you feed me. I am so full after this weekend. I'm gonna get emotional right now, so I'm not careful, because I think other people are getting emotional, just because there's this energy of pouring out. Uh, we pour out into each other, and it takes a village to do what we do, to love one another and to recognize each other and say, you know what, we're okay. We're really, really okay. You make this happen, you do, you do. So thank you, and I love you so freaking much, and you better be here in July <laughs> and in my pink car where we can tune up and down the alleyways of this hotel and have pink candy floss and you guys can throw pies in my face for charity, because I said it here, because I love you. You are the friendship. You are the magic. You are the universe of My Little Pony. It's all because of you, and thank you so much. I love you so hard! to do a cooking segment on my little tonight show do it you think we could do this do this because i'm very much like java because i'll be adding two cups as opposed to two tablespoons so anyway come back in july we'll see what we cook up literally in Let's july cook it how up. does that sound we'll take some requests give us your requests please raise your hand if this is your first convention 
convention and or first shot con ever. You survived the week. Uh, <laughs> you survived. You survived. We love you. My first track time was such an experience. I have been here ever since. And I just hope that all of you guys who come here for the first time, or come to a con for your first time, have a really good experience this weekend. And I hope that you have had the best possible experience you could have had with not only this con, but with this fandom and community that you guys, I, I hope I see you all again. So again, me thanking you guys for being here because we all wouldn't be here without you. So please, thank you. Give, her, give yourselves a round of applause again, please. Absolutely. Thank each and every one of you for being here. Thank you for coming to TrotCon. Anyway, you came to TrotCon. You can officially say that now. I love each and every one of you. TrotCon loves each and every one of you. I love all of you. Um, any closing words from you guys before we end? I just close it out. Hey, I'm Ryan. I'm Jason. 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 I'm